Welcome to Hobby Adventures. Today, we're gonna talk about my excitement! Yeah! All right, so last night I ended up getting a phone call from my local hobby store. Uh, now, something that I ordered about a year and a half ago finally came in and I'm on my way to get it. <laughs> well, I figured that I would share this with you guys. So I am in my car on my way to the hobby store to go get what I ordered. So I'm really super excited. You guys are lucky because you don't have to wait and drive through traffic to get to it. So I have about <laughs> traffic it'll probably end up feeling like about two hours but uh, I'm guessing about maybe 45 minutes and to boot it, what doesn't help is today is kind of a drizzy day eh. not exactly too happy about that anyways let's get it going So after about 45 minutes of driving, one coffee and a bagel, we are finally here at my hobby store. So let me run inside and go get what I need to get. All right, just came out of the hobby store, got what I came for, and I'm not gonna tell you guys just yet. <laughs> you guys are gonna have to hold on like another two more seconds. I'm gonna drive home, we're gonna take a look at what I got, and it's gonna be awesome, yeah! <laughs> All right, so I'm back at home, super excited to show you guys what I picked up. I know I'm prolonging this, but just wanna tease you guys a little bit more. So without further ado, I am gonna roll a short clip. Turbo is a positive expression of this fast-paced era, a symbol of man's ability to employ creative technology to serve the needs of a mobile society. The Toronto-Montreal corridor experiment could be the basis for a new kind of service between other close yet heavily populated areas. Turbo itself is considered a first step, not a final solution. That is right everyone, I did pick myself up an N-scale turbo train by Ropedo Inc. So far from what I saw, oh, it's a beautiful train, beautiful train. <laughs> So ended up getting a full set. So that means that I got two, yeah, two. <laughs> I ended up getting two of these boxes. I am not gonna do a complete review right now. I'm gonna save that for another time, but I just wanna quickly share with you guys this. <clears throat> so comes out this bag, beautiful casing, beautiful casing. Pull it out of the sleeve. Oh man, this is awesome. Then check this out, this is a bookcase, so it's really nice. Oh yeah. All right, so there's a whole bunch of stuff to read. Yeah, I am gonna read my manual, comes with a manual. All right, so the paint scheme that I went with was the CN version. Uh, I don't want it drop, so. <laughs> All right, the second one right here, pull this out of, this, out of the plastic. Same thing as the first one. Just, I can't get over the gloss and the finish of this book. It is spectacular. And the other four passenger cars right here. So that gives me a complete eight car set. Oh, super nice. Here, let me show it to you one more time. I 
All right, so that is enough for the teaser. I am gonna put together a product review, as I said, and really, I'm just super excited about getting it onto the layout and giving it a shot and see how it goes. Guys, until next time, keep on modeling.